Hey everyone, and welcome to my channel. Um, today we are gonna do some cash stuffing slash condensing, and we're also going to go over um, a little bit of Happy Mail and um, budgeting for the month. So I went through, um, this month I've been really trying hard to uh, document everything. I do still need to figure out a way to do like um, cash that I've been doing, and we're also going to go over um, what we saved in the month of November. I have it all tallied up here. Remember, this money is not here again, just like last month, because I have been using it to get Christmas this year. Um, where did I put that stuff? Oh, hang on a second. I thought I had it right here, but it's not. Oh, here it is. Okay. Here it is. I found it. Let's see. Okay. So first, let's go over the budget. No. First, let's go over what we saved in the month of November. Let's do that, and then we'll go from there. So these are all the challenges that were in my red folder. Again, this money is gone. I've been spending it on Christmas and stuff. So we have the uh, challenges that we did with um, Lisa Grateful Me, um, Donna Powered by Creativity, um, who else? Kelsey from Budget Better Life and Bianca from Plan.Live.Budget. Um, so let's get those out and let me see if I can find them. Okay, so I already know what I've saved up, but I did that ahead of time, but I wanted to share with you guys what I've done. Okay, so this one is Lisa's and if you go to her first collaboration video, I think through any of her other collaboration videos that she has, you can still purchase, or not purchase, but you can still get this freebie. So, um, this is the envelope that goes with it. So we saved $30 with this. Let's go ahead and pop that into the calculator. So $30, can y'all see that? Yeah, okay. Let me put that right there. Okay, so then we have Miss Donna's, who's in here as well. Hers was how snowflakes are made, her interpretation. Frosty poots them out. <laughs> and with this one, we also saved $30. So we saved another 30 bucks on there. Oh, 30 plus 30 plus. Okay, then we had Kelsey's from Budget Better Life and hers was a $30 savings. She gives you two and I made an envelope out of it, but you can do like a roll and save on the back. So, um, I might reprint this and do this for next year's Christmas. So we're gonna put $30 there. And then we also saved 30 with Miss Bianca. She gives you a dashboard. I just taped it onto um, a little envelope that I made. The inside's all glittery. And then she also gives you two. These ones you can color in, and then there's one you can just mark off. So $30 with Miss Bianca. So we saved $120 just with that collab, which is awesome. And then <clears throat> we, we did this one here that is from Miss Janelle Ray, and that was $100. Then we went ahead and finished this Thankful and Blessed from Snow Gardener 307, and that was $100. Then we finished these little freebies from um, Lenova B. This is her uh, Etsy. So she's got a dog, let's see. A cat named Luna, a dog named Nova, and then her name is Brittany, so she puts a B. So I finished these two little scratchers, and that was $50 for both of them together. And then we finished this fall fun from Snow Gardener 307, which was another $100. And then we finished another one from Snow Gardener 307, which was Christmas on my mind, which I love this one. I would love to have them for next year, um, but I am doing a hard no spend for December. Um, so this one is from Tracy from Golden Girl Budgets. This is her hot cocoa. So we saved $100 with that one. We also did the Christmas Village from Tracy over at Snow Garden. Uh, sorry, from Budget. Oh my gosh. Golden Girl Budgets. Sorry, girl. And so we'll add another 100 to that. And then we did Leg Day from Miss Liz over at Liz and Less, and this is a sticker, a huge sticker, so you can save them and like 
put them somewhere. I already have another one that I finished from her. So that one was $75. And then we finished just the top portion of my Snowball Fun, which is over on my um, Etsy, um, which I'll have linked down below. If you wanna do a extra, it says 50 plus. The extra is you can roll a dice and save that amount into these little snowballs down below. But I didn't do that, I just saved the 50, so we're gonna include that. And then this one is another one on my Etsy store. This one is the ugly sweater savings. Look at the little doggy and the sweater, isn't that cute? Okay, so you saved 50 with this one and you get a matching envelope. So 50 bucks there. Then we did Donna's uh, freebie from Veterans Day, which was um, on her channel. You can go to her channel on Veterans Day and you can find this freebie. I probably will get it again, I don't know but or reprint it um so this one saved us 45 dollars so we'll add that then we've got bud uh budget with mama bear so um this is her envelope that you get and then here is the challenge it is a winter savings so so fun and this one saved us 80 bucks so we're gonna put 80 in there and then last but not least actually from the challenges last but not least we have this one from my uh, Etsy store it saved you hundred and ten dollars okay so that is what we saved with um, challenges only one thousand one hundred and eighty dollars then we also did a no spin challenge with um, this is from Donna powered by creativity and she has a dot com and she also has a um, Etsy store. I believe this one I got from her Etsy store. So here is my November, month of November, spending, tracking. And I only did Etsy and Amazon this go around. So for November, I had 21 days of no spend, which I uh, allotted $5 for each no spend. And that's all the hearts. And then I had nine days where I spent money on Etsy. And when I spent money, I didn't uh, put any money in there. So our first week we spent, or we saved $30 with our no spend. The second week we saved $25. The third week we saved $20. And then our fourth week we did really well and we saved $30 again. So our grand total for that was $105, which I did put in my envelope, but it is empty now. Um, I took that money and used it for Christmas. Um, this money that I'll be putting in December will not be spent on Christmas. I am going to roll that over. So we're going to do, I might get it out in December and then in January, start fresh and do January and then February and then get the money out. That's kind of how Donna does it. She does it every other month where she'll get her monies out. But um, I've already got it prepped for December. So no spends are gonna be $5 again. Spending money, well, you won't put any money in here. And then I've got our weekly layout where we can jot down how much we saved per week and then our total spent. So we're gonna start that one again. I think I'm gonna continue this all year long because I'm really gonna try to hit debt hard this year. So <clears throat> we did save $105 with that. So our grand total of savings this month was 1,285 and that was in completed challenges and the no spend. Okay, so I didn't write the no spend down in here. So this is gonna be off a little bit. And I did my best to track down what we spent um, on the card and stuff. Like cash is not in included in this. And this is only our joint banking account. So I really did, I tried really hard. And if you like this uh, expense tracker, I got this from um, Lisa Grateful Me, who is the Happy Mailbox Co over at, on Etsy. So I have one, two, three, four trackers worth of um, expenses. So I took that, uh, instead of going through those all detailed like, I took that and I broke it down. So um, for food slash groceries, this I had food broke up into two different categories. Uh, groceries and then going out and like fast food and that kind of stuff. So food slash groceries, we spent $779.90 this month. Gas, we spent an 
this may not really tr be true because I'm pretty sure there was a couple cash purchases for gas. So 164 20 and 20 cents. Dining out slash food, um, that was $833.18. Those little quick stops at like McDonald's or whatever, those add up so quickly. And with having three kids, it's it's a lot. You know, we, we do a little quick stop uh, stops at the uh, food, fast foods a lot of times when we're out and about with the kids, you know, doctor's appointments and things like that. So that we're going to have to figure out a way to get that one to go down. Um, shopping was $203 and 36 cents. And I can go ahead and tell you this was all me. And this was only from Etsy and Amazon. That's it. Etsy and Amazon, $203.36 the entire month, which is not bad considering, you know, I was trying to be conscientious and I have let a lot of things go that I really didn't want. Um, vape and tobacco. I vape, my husband does tobacco. He does um, cigarettes and uh, skull. He dips skull at work. So that was $123.95. I normally only have to get two vapes an entire month. I just do the disposable ones. Um, I stopped smoking like two years ago, so I do still vape them. Christmas, we did spend $38.06 out of the bank. Bet the uh, bills and debt, we spent $1,787.55. Um, so those are, you know, you have to pay. Um, <clears throat> hopefully in the next year, this will go down tremendously because I'm going to try to get the personal loan paid off and the uh, van, we have a van. We're gonna try to get that van payment off of us. Um, and then if we still have time, we'll try to get a credit card paid off of us too. And we're definitely gonna get the Lowe's credit card taken care of at the first of the month, or first of the year. So household, we had $434.97. Now, I can go ahead and tell you that this month, that is going to be almost obsolete. Um, we did go buy new bedding for our beds. I get really cold. Um, so we went and got some flannel sheets and then I seen a bedding set that I really liked. We've also gotten pillows for our bed and then, you know, household things such as, um, dishwasher detergent, laundry soaps, shampoos and conditioners, that kind of stuff is also included in that. So that's why that one's so big this month. Subscriptions was $39.06 and I wish I would have done this last month because this would have been over, well over $100.00. We got rid of so many subscriptions this month and I'm so excited about it. The only subscriptions that we have currently are Canva, Netflix, and then my husband um, does a couple Xbox things. So, um, and then we have miscellaneous and this was purchases that I could not tie to a particular group or I wasn't sure what the, um, purchase was made for. So that is $68.58, um, which I think is okay for an entire month, you know. And then medical, we had $23, and this was all prescriptions. So our grand total was $4,495.81. And then for savings, it was, I put the um, scratchers, which was 1,180, and then let's see, 1,180 plus two or 105. So that should have been 1,285. So this would be plus 4,495, 81. So our uh, new grand total would have been, let me get a new 5,000. $783.81. So that would have been our actual expenses. So we're going to track it again this month and we're going to see, sorry for shaking you, we're going to see how um, it fluctuates this month and then from there we will figure out what we can do to lower our cost of living. Um, so yeah, wanted to go over that with you guys. <clears throat> Then let's get some Happy Meal out of the way and then we will cash stuff. Um, so I did get these. I, uh, 
I got these a while back from Donna, Powered by Creativity, and I went ahead and printed them off. I'm going to start these in the new year. So these are like little monthly um, envelopes. I've still got to tape them together and uh, hole punch them, but yeah. So I think that most of them save $100, so that would be cool. I'm going to add that to mine, and then there's another one that I have included in that. So let's get into, let's see, Liz and Les was the first one. Let me do it like this. I'm going to go in order as the order I got them. Okay. So this one is from Liz and Les. Now, i seen this over at Budget, no, Mischief Manage Budgets. And um, her name is Wren. And so uh, she had made this for Wren. She loves birds. And I just thought this was too darn cute. I want to do this one for February because it's love birds, right? So, um, I had to pick this one up, so I grabbed that. <clears throat> so, thank you, Miss Liz. I love it. And I have some more coming. It's on its way. Um, this one is from Save with Judy. It says, thank you for supporting my small business. Please don't bend. So, Save with Judy. And Judy, I did not realize that you live very close to me. That's really cool to have a fellow um, savings buddy that lives really close so it says thank you her card and it says thank you for the purchase i hope you enjoyed get 10 percent off your next purchase and it's she signed it judy so she was giving these away with one of her um giveaways that she just recently did and i just thought these were so darn cute and they kind of go with what i am doing and she has a little thank you sticker on there she has um it's kind of going with a theme that I did for a couple of my challenges that are already up on my Etsy store. So if you haven't been by lately, I added quite a few new uh, savings challenges so you can go check it out. But she said she sent these or she showed these with her um, her giveaway. And I loved them so much I ran over there and got them. So it's let's make a taco. This one saves you $100. Let's make a pizza. And this one saves you $100. Let's make a burger. Save $100. And let's make a hot dog. <laughs> save $50. So super cute. I had to grab them. So thank you so much. Let's see. Oh, and she sent me some freebies. Let's see what's in the freebies. And that was Save with Judy. Okay. So we've got a really cute little reindeer, <clears throat> a little, looks like a chow chow with a blue, a purple tongue, little doggy, and a Santa, looks like he's drinking himself a martini, how cute is that? It's piled up by the hundred presents. Then we've got a save with Judy, scratch, have a scratch on me, and this is her information. If you have not checked her out, please go do so, she's really sweet, and she does some really cool savings challenges. So there's that. And then a thank you card that <clears throat> says, I am honored you chose my Etsy shop for your budget needs. Wishing you all the best on your financial journey. So they're safe with Judy. And then last but not least, oh, a laminated bank teller cash slip. So very, very nice. Thank you. Thank you, Miss Judy. All right. Next up, we've got another one from Miss Golden Girl Budgets. My Tracy <laughs> had to get some goodies from her for Black Friday. Okay, making sure that was empty. All right, let's see. Oh my gosh, I love it, I love it. So she always gives these really cool stickers where you um, add the pieces to build this, the little um, character or whatever. And this one is a taco, oh my gosh. I love it, I love it, I love it. Can't wait to put that on. Um, I think I'm gonna put that on your folder for your savings challenges. And it says, you're a peach. Uh, Tiffany, your goal for 2024 is to stick to a no spend. Thanks, friend Tracy. <laughs> I know, Tracy, but girl, I had to support you. So this one was one that she just recently come out with. This is a little garden, and I do love to garden in the spring, so I thought that would be fun to buy the seeds and such. I also do flower gardening, so... Um, yeah, I kind of go overboard, so I'm, I'm going to try to stick to my budget, though. I'm going to try to stick to my budget, Trace. 
This one is a $50 and I just had to have this because we've got three little girls. Easter is a big thing in our household. So uh, I'm gonna use this to save for Easter. I thought it was too darn cute. This here is a $50 savings challenge. And when she showed this one, uh, my heart was like fluttering because these are like my, this is like my palette. This is the color scheme that I absolutely adore. My favorite color is blue, but I also really love the peaches and the corals. And oh yes, yes, yes. Loved it. I had to get it. Then we have a $75 savings challenge that has some little cute kitties at the beach. And I don't know if I'm going to use this for pets or if I'm going to use this for vacation. I ha I got her dog one that she uh, has in her shop. So I had to get that one, the kitty kitty. We have a cat and a dog. And then um, this is a $100 savings challenge. And I had to pick this one up. Tracy doesn't know this, but my birthday is July 3rd. And this is... Um, Independence Day kind of like you know red white and blue and it's cupcakes for his like birthday so I had to grab this one because it's like uh, hello that could be perfect for my birthday so thank you so much Tracy I love them I love them okay next up we have Donna powered by creativity and I buy a ton of digital downloads from this lady she is amazing at digital downloads and I've been eyeballing a lot of her um, her scratch-offs so I wanted to go ahead and get a few of her scratch-offs um, and so I got a few that would go with the only one I didn't get was the um, and I need to go back and grab it because I did see it after the fact um, she does okay let's go through this first okay so Donna's village oh I can put that on her envelope for her scratchers perfect thank you so much Donna and then it says, Donna Powered by Creativity, thank you so much for your purchase. Connect with me. So there is her website, her Etsy, her YouTube, and her Instagram. So definitely go check this lady out. She is awesome. She sent me a five, uh, $10 uh, placeholder. So thank you, thank you. And this is what I ordered. So we got the I Love Lucy say let's say forty dollars and i have her digital download of this so i had to pick this one up i love i love lucy and i need to get i've been working on trying to find a good image i want to do a um another couple older movies like this but i gotta find the images first <clears throat> so then we have um groot let's save this one is for fifty dollars so when she does this she does this in two different denominations she'll do a low budget and she also does a high budget so i and then i also got because it happens this one's 150 dollars. i did do the higher denomination for this one the only one that i did not get that i really wanted was the um the um how many licks does it take challenge i wanted to get the scratch off of it but i could only find the uh higher denomination and i wanted the lower denomination but after I went back on her shop, I did see the lower denomination one. So that will be in my next purchase. So there is that. And then this is from Lenova B. And it says, sending sunshine your way. This comes all the way from Canada, right? Yes. So this comes from Canada. Woo -woo. Super exciting. I have purchased from her before and her stuff is very nice quality. Um, we finished two of the little freebies that she gave us last time, last month. So I went and grabbed a couple more things from her. Okay, so this is the freebie that she sent and this is her Luna and her Nova. And it says, Tiffany, thank you for placing another order with my shop. Your support means a lot. Happy saving, Brittany. So there we go. All right, and I will have these ladies linked down below, of course. If they have an Etsy store, I'll put the Etsy, their .com and everything. So, just like with Tracy doing the whole chicken um, savings challenge, I had to pick this one up. This one is a pig farm. <laughs> I have pigs and I have chickens. So, um, yeah, I had to pick this one up. This one was $70, and it's so cute. It's laminated very very sturdy it's very nice i like it thank you so much nova or Brittany. sorry oh she sent me a freebie um she sent me a freebie look at that 
This is such nice quality, Brittany. Very, very good. So, um, if I unveil the little red mushroom, I say $5. And if I unveil a, um, like, bad guy mushroom, I'll save $10. So, super cute. This is Mario. <clears throat> and then I also purchased this from her. This is... Never have I ever. Roll a dice and move along the board. Scratch the space you land on. If you have done it, save $10. If you haven't done it, save $5. So I thought this was super, super cute. And I thought this would be fun to play along with you guys. And so that you could get to know me a little bit better. And so I went ahead and grabbed this. Um, okay. So that is my happy meal. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I really am excited about it all. Um, let's go ahead and get into our savings challenges. Now, we have 150, 250, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, 100, I think that's supposed to be four. Okay, we're bringing this in. I hate 50s, but I needed them. So 100 plus 20, uh, 50, 150, 150. So there's 250 right there. I think I had done messed up right there. I don't know. 20, 40, 60, 81 plus 100 plus 100. There we go. So there's 350. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. No, wait. I don't know what I was doing. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Y'all, I don't know what's going on with me today. There's the 400. 5, 10, plus 10, plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. There we go. 415. That's what we're saving today. And just so you guys know, I did take all the money out of all my um, challenges. And we um, went and we got bigger bills so we could condense it um so yeah part of this is we're saving about 200 dollars extra than what we normally would so we're going to start off with my higher savings we're not going to touch 2024 this right now but we are going to go into our um koala 52 weeks koala and so we were going to save $52 this week and we had saved 45 from last week. So $97 is what I wanted to put into this, this envelope. So we're going to do the smallest denominations possible because we still have quite a bit to get into this envelope. So we're going to do a 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97. So that's how we're going to do it. And then we'll condense again if we need to later on. But I wanted to make this the smallest bills possible. So there we go. $97 going into this envelope. Now, <clears throat> next week we are going to, I've already got it figured out. We're going to do this entire envelope, which I believe was only $45. Let me make sure. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oh no, fifty-five. My bad, fifty-five. So we're gonna put fifty-five dollars into this envelope for next week. Okay. All right. Now this is a new one that I picked up from Donna, powered by Creativity. This is a Tinker Bell challenge, and here is the large envelope for it. So you see 10's marked off. We're going to put $10 in it today. This is basically a 100 envelope challenge. Uh, she's just broke it down just like um, Miss Lisa did with the Koala 52 week. And she's given us envelopes for all of it. So to help us break it down a little bit better. So we're going to put a $10 bill into this challenge today. And I'm not sure what we'll do next week, but I wanted to go ahead and jump start and get this one going. So we'll put $10 in this one. And that, I believe, is all for this challenge. Okay, we're going to head on over to, let's start our monthly or our yearly, whatever you want to call it. So this one is from my shop, so you can definitely go over to my shop and pick this up. Uh, you can get it laminated or non-laminated. Lawn, blah, blah, blah. 
non-laminated, however you would like. But it's every month you save $50. <clears throat> so at the end, you'll save 600 bucks. So we have six plus eight plus eight plus one. So we need to save $23 here. And we already had, you know, 14 or something like that, 13. So I took that out and we're going to do this in smaller denominations. I'm not sure where I got this one, but this one will be the next one that I do. Either this one, pro yeah, probably this one because it saves 80. And then after we finish that, we're going to try to go through and finish this. If we can get this all done by the end of February, that'd be, or January, that'd be fantastic. So, <clears throat> okay. So we're going to put 20. One, two, three. 23 into this challenge for today. And let's go ahead and scratch off so we know what we're saving next week. <clears throat> and I'm sorry, I'm not, ooh, $9. This one is gonna take a little bit of money this week. And um, yeah, I don't scratch off and then put the money in. It's because I just, the way our budget is, I have to know what we're saving when we're saving it. So we're going to do a $9 and who, okay, let's just continue on the route we're on. $9 and $5, so 14 bucks. Okay, so 14 for next week. What we're going to save. All right. So we'll say 14 next week. And this is done for today. All right. All right, next off we are going to, let me put these up. We're gonna get into our um, monthly or, or scratch offs and stuff such. Let me find. Let's start from the back and go forward. Okay, so for this one, where did it go? Oh, here it is. This is from um, the Happy Mailbox Co. I did only have to the six put off, but I went ahead and went to the nine because that is $45 and I wanted it to be kind of even. So we are going to put 40 and five. So $45 is going into this challenge here. <clears throat> okay. And then next week, uh, let's see, I already have it marked. We are going to do the 10, the 11, the 12, the 13, the 14, and the 15. So we are going to try to really hurry up and get this one going. Um, I did find the challenge for that other one, but I decided not to go along with it. So we're going to just mock that one out. And I went ahead and got rid of the Home Alone because I just realized, you know, I don't have enough time to get all that done. So we'll do that one next year. Oops, sorry. All right, next we're gonna do the winter savings and we're gonna do five, uh, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. We're doing 50 bucks in here and I have a $50 bill. And then next week we are also going to do $50. So we got all the tens out of the way. So next week we'll put the 50 in and then let's see five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. So the week after next, we will be completed with this because I am going to go ahead and put that last amount into it. So there is $50 for this week, and the next week we'll put 50 I know that I don't do it a lot like everybody else does, but um, I hope to get that way pretty soon. It's just right now I'm really trying to get all of our Christmas saved up for. Okay, so now... There's more stickers put on here than what we had. I went ahead and added some. So we have $150 covered up already. So there is my 150. All right. And let's see. What can we do for next week? This is going to save us $325 when we're done. So let's do 19, 18, 17, 16, that's $70, let's see, 6 plus 7 plus 8 plus 9 plus 10 plus 11 plus 12 plus 13 plus, all right, 
15 plus 15. Okay, that's what we'll do. We're going to do the 19, 18, 17, and 16. So we're going to go ahead and cover those on up. And I am super excited to be getting this one done. These are two huge ones that I want to get out of the way. And hopefully that will just about finish up my Christmas shopping for this year. And then we can start focusing on debt and um, our other goals. And we're going to save for Christmas starting in January for next year because I do not want to do this like hurry up and try to get it done. And then we're, once we finish this one, we're going to start this Happy New Year. I created this. It's on my Etsy store if you're interested. The denominations are only one through eight, and you're going to save 50 bucks. So there is that one. There's our 150. Let's put that in the back. And let's go on. We have 10, 20, 30, and 40 dollars left. 10, 20, let's see. 10, 20, 30, and 40. Okay, yeah. So here is another big savings that I'm going to do. I'm also got the 1500, but I'm not going to start that one just yet. So we're going to put six, two, and two in here. So that's $10. We're going to put $10 into Roger Rabbit this week. This is the $500 amount, and this is the um, combination. It's the envelope and the challenge all in one. This is from Donna, powered by Creativity. She also has it where you can get the paper and the envelope, but I did the combination because I wanted the 500 and I also wanted the 1500 because the 1500 will probably go towards um, some debt. Also got the Scooby-Doo Challenge and the Good Luck Bear, but we are not doing those today. Um, we'll start those eventually. Um, the Tootsie Pop I shared with you guys last week. Where did I put? There they are. Let's see, Tootsie Pop, we are saving 10 bucks with that one. And I've already got my uh, next $10 lined up. The ones that I have completed, I'm going to put little brown sticks on them, orangey sticks on them. I know that's not the color, but that's how I'm doing it. So we'll put $10 into the Tootsie Pop this week. There we go. And then we have I Am Groot, so, so cute. And we are going to do this section right here. It says I am Groot, and then it has two little icons down here. So all these icons up top are going to be five dollars. Then this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's going to be worth ten dollars. So this can be a hundred dollar challenge. So we are going to put ten dollars into Groot today. Okay, and then because it happens, I love this challenge. I think it's so darn cute. We are going to put ten dollars into it. So a little poop emoji. Um, and I put those worth 10 and then I put the hearts worth five. So we're going to put $10 into because it happens. And that is all of our money. So I did it correctly. Yay. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> okay. So I hope you guys have a wonderful week. Let me know down in the comments below. Did y'all go Black Friday shopping? Did you have a good Thanksgiving? Um, did you find any good deals? I did. I found, um... What did I find? I found a um, new uh, air fryer at Walmart for 50 bucks. It was originally a hundred and my air fryer is like probably going on 10 years old now. And so uh, it was, sometimes it would work, sometimes it wouldn't. And um, so this one dehydrates, it air fries, it bakes, it does all kinds of stuff. So it's really nice. Um, so let me guys know what you guys got on Black Friday and um, what um, kind of awesome savings did you get. I'll see you guys next week. Bye, everyone.